What's good, my people? Your boy Gizzy Credit here. How you guys doing? Start of summer. Thank God over here in Jersey. We're having awesome days. Uh, my birthday's coming up, so definitely that's something good. Anyways, my people, shout out to the new subscribers. Uh, I know that after 10,000 subscribers, I'm still climbing up. I'm up to uh, 10,500 of you who I'm responsible. Who you look to respond? Who you look to? For your education on star as credit repair is concerned you like the way that i uh do my thing here on these videos and you subscribe and i just want to say thank you i'm still going to come harder and harder this year especially this summer i got a lot of videos uh to let you guys know what i'm doing and that things that hope that are working so definitely that's something good for you uh to watch and see and you know see everyone else that has been growing while in the credit repair process so you already know how to contact me 973-440-8661 that is the main number that you guys either text message or call if you're just calling for information on how to start the process of credit repair just text message me your email address uh, to this phone number or leave a comment below sometimes i may not get to the comments as fast as usual but i promise you that i'm getting back to all comments by the end of june Anyways, uh, this video is an extremely important video and I know it's going to be one of my best videos because this video, a lot of times when you see me and you see other credit repair companies, you only see the, the results as far as how, how people, success stories. And uh, this video is going to be a real talk video, especially you who had just finished starting credit repair with me. Uh, because it's going to talk about how you are not going to be successful in the program if you don't follow these things that, I, that, that, that I'm going to talk about right now. So it's definitely something important for you to listen to, especially if you just started the process. And I'm going to add this video on the congratulations on committing to credit repair email once you guys uh, already sign up with us. You got a quote. You gave me all your information. You started credit repair. Boom, you do an intake call with my, with my partner and also uh, you need to see where you're going to be at in the next three, six months, six to 12 months. So right now we're going to talk about a file, two files, a couple who started back in December and they recently asked for their monies back. Now, I know this video may turn some people off, but I know it's going to grab the attention of the right customer who I'm looking to help. So I know what this video is doing as far as the people who subscribe to my channel, all you that watch my videos, and all you who are currently right now saving up in order to start the process with me. So I want this to be extremely smooth to you so that you understand what the process takes to come through for you, all right? So we're gonna talk about uh, things to watch out for or uh, the importance of keeping uh, the integrity with what I'm going to do for you and what you should do in the process. So you just started, you have some uh, negative accounts on your credit report, you have some existing accounts that you're paying on, and you haven't, uh, you, you're currently up to date with everything. How are you not going to be successful in the process? Well, easy, okay? Let's follow these, listening to, to these steps. You watch me what I'm talking about right now, but this is very important as far as how you're going to be successful in our credit repair process. So the importance of keeping credit monitoring, okay? Credit monitoring is one of the most important things that you should keep as far as while in the credit repair process, whether you're doing it or whether someone else is doing it, you have to be responsible for you. You have to be, you have to see what's going on with you in order to see what results you're getting from whoever is helping you with your credit, okay? The credit monitoring that we go by is Credit Check Total or Equifax.com. You can have my FICO, Experian, and all that, but we just go by Credit Check Total and Equifax.com. Do not go by Credit Karma. Credit Karma is bogus. Credit Karma is owned by TransUnion. They say they are for free, but they only they have bogus credit scoring model. All right, TransUnion never came up with a with a credit scoring model like Experian, Vantage, or 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 Equifax. 
Okay, so Equifax is used on the, everyone uses Equifax, okay, especially you people down south uh, and Midwest. Uh, but please don't go by Credit Karma. I know it's very easy for you to have on your phone and for you to say, hey, um, you know, this is Credit Karma. They're going to come through for me because they're free. They tell me they keep me up to date. No, Credit Karma is bogus. Get it deleted from your phone. I don't like to talk about all the businesses out there because, you know, I'm all about giving business to people. But Credit Karma is really the worst. They're only going to confuse you. And I really, when you, when, when I get a customer who contacts me and it's like, oh, Gizzy, my credit score went down, my, my, this, I got another a negative account added, and where'd you see it at? Oh, Credit Karma. Don't go by Credit Karma. Credit Karma is bogus. They're going to drive you crazy. And you're going to drive yourself crazy if you have like three credit monitorings right now. All you need is like Credit Check Total or Equifax.com. And as long as you can update all three bureaus on Equifax or Credit Check Total, you are going to be fine. Okay, so let's jump on. Um, the other thing that you should not do while in the credit repair process, and that is run your credit, okay? Stop running inquiries on your file. You're only going to make my job harder, all right, when you go out there and you're not done with the credit repair, but yet you're going out there running your credit. Is you defeating the purpose. It's like you're paying me to do something, but yet you're doing the opposite. Don't do that. All right, so uh, do not add any negative accounts. Right now, whatever you are paying on right now, keep paying on it. If you get a collection notice from a, a company that you haven't paid, the best thing to do is to pay it off or call them to set up a payment plan so it won't report on your credit report, okay? So another thing that um, uh, judgments, okay? Do not add any negative accounts. I'm not responsible for whatever new that you get. You are responsible for that. All right, I'm only responsible for whatever is negative on your credit report that I need to remove. All right, so what happens is you think you're getting this negative account added to your credit report and you're like, I need you to work on it ASAP. Well, if you are in the middle of the dispute, I can't dispute that account. You have to wait until that dispute is over and then dispute it with the rest. Okay, so always be mindful of that. And I always tell customers, listen, be mindful of this situation because it's gonna extend the credit repair process for you. I'm already doing I'm already going as fast as humanly, as fast as legally possible. I'm I'm gonna go. Okay. But if you keep adding negative accounts, it's going to just prolong the process. I'll still work on that negative account, but if you start getting more negative accounts, I'm afraid I'm gonna have to charge a little bit more money. Uh, for that because this is additional work that I'm doing okay so um, let's also talk about whatever you get in the mail forward it over to us okay so once you start with me you know I'm not the only one here that's helping you with your credit I have a team of people who help you with your credit okay I know that you may see me and you think that I'm doing everything no I get you involved with, with, the, with the service and I have my back office and my back office is the one that handles all the disputes and is going to put you in the right direction that you need to go, okay? So always send, send whatever email not notifications, whatever you think you get on the, uh, as a mail, forward it over to our back office so we keep tabs on your progress. Um, also, um, Remember that some disputes that we send out, we're going to dispute online, but we can't dispute online the next uh, time that we dispute. We have to dispute by mail because there's a grace period and we don't want to waste any time. The only way that I'm going to know what to dispute next is if you have credit monitoring and I'm able to see what's left to remove. So that's why it's so important to update your credit monitoring on a monthly basis Especially if you have Equifax.com or Credit Check Total, they're going to charge you anywhere from $29.95 a month. So be mindful of that. Are you truck drivers out there that you not have a home or whatever, you leave and you come back in a week, two weeks, be mindful of that. If you have somebody who's looking out for you, who are, who's going to get uh, in the mail, be mindful of that. Also, some disputes are, are always run on 30 days unless... We, uh, we send, we send uh, dispute online, you're gonna get results online. So congratulations to you on starting credit repair. I don't wanna scare you, all right? But you need to be on top of whatever you're doing right now because I'm gonna be on top of whatever I'm doing. That's why I hate being micromanaged. 
You believe that? Like I'm doing my thing and then you other people get negative accounts? No, we don't want to do that. We want to do everything the right way, legit, so it could be a smooth process. Maybe three months, six months, nine months, 12 months from now, you're buying your home, you're buying a new car, you're getting your business loan. Let's talk about that right now. So, let's see. So before we start with the second half of the video is I wanted to show you a story of why this couple wasn't able to be satisfied with my service. And one, a lot of the reasons why this couple wasn't able to get faster, better results was because of everything that I just started talking about. So right now we're going to go on to their file and we're going to see about this. Okay, We're going to see how these people, they contact me. I'm able to stay on top of everything. I'm emailing. I just want you to listen to this because this is a crazy story. But in the credit repair business or in any business, you're gonna have you're gonna have people you're gonna have people who are gonna be like, I want my money back. And if they signed an agreement, you have to honor that agreement. That's what we do. Not a lot of people talk about the the things that they weren't successful in, but you know what? I'm going to share that story with you so you know how it is being in the credit repair business. And I know many of you purchase our professional credit repair system and you're actively doing credit repair. So right now, you're going to feel me on this type of customer. <laughs> Anyways, let's get with the video. Hope you enjoy it. Let's talk right now about the customer who uh, started um negative who has negative accounts on his credit report and um this was the husband's file so this couple came to me back in december they came to visit me uh, i live in jersey so um they came from chicago illinois and they came to visit me at a starbucks on route 3 in clifton new jersey and i don't mind meeting with people uh but you know if you're in Jersey or whatever, I, I just don't want to talk about the same thing over and over. I just meet with people who are ready to move forward with the process so they know that, you know, I'm serious about this. You know, I want to help people out. I just don't, don't want to mess around and, and just talk to people and BS. Not about that life. Anyways, this is what the husband uh, came uh, to me with. As you can see, they, they're going to need trade lines after credit repair. Uh, these were the negative accounts. Uh, that they have on all three bureaus, okay? And look at all these inquiries and public records right now, all right? So this was the husband's file, okay? So this was back in December, what it looked like. Now let's look at what the file looks like today. If you see uh, right over here, uh, he only has four negative uh, accounts uh, left. Um, one negative was what he added a late payment on his credit report. So, you know, that's what I mean about, um, I'll be done faster if these negative accounts, uh, are not on the credit report. I'll, I'll, I'll have three negative accounts and this is all in six months. You still see the inquiries down there, but remember that we go after the negative accounts first before we go after the inquiries. So let's now talk about uh, the wife's uh, file. Right here, as you can see, she's maxed out on her credit utilization, so definitely will need trade lines after credit repair. Do you see, customer has a lot of negative accounts that need to be removed from each bureau, including a whole bunch of inquiries, and look at the public records here below. Let's look at what her report looks like now after six months. If you see, I'm still working on uh, two public records on, on Equifax and one negative account. And this one negative account was the late payment on her car loan that she added. So on top of her not updating her report on all three bureaus, I wasn't able to come through uh, for them. They, I, they probably updated their reports probably three times in the last five or six months that they've been with me. So uh, this is what happens when, um, you know, you, you say, Gizzy, I'm not happy with the service, but why are you not happy? You know, let me look at you guys so that you could see my face. 
So what happened to this couple and why wasn't this couple able to get faster results? I mean, from all three bureaus, I came, I was coming through for them. But understand that that file has a lot of negatives, has a lot of inquiries that need to be removed. While I'm trying to fix your credit, you need to, when I tell you to update all three bureaus, now this is going to cost $29.95 that I'm not responsible for. This is you supposed to be take responsibility and have credit monitoring on the side so that you can see that I'm doing my job. Okay, so if you're going to start the credit repair process, you need to be mindful that, hey, I need to put some money aside, at least $30 a month in order to update all three bureaus. How long are you going to be paying credit monitoring? until we are done. It could take 30 days, or it could take three months, six months, nine months, 12 months. Okay, many of you know and see my videos through Instagram that this can happen to you. Let's see. Hey, with your boy Izzy Credit here, back again with some more results. This time for a customer out in East Elmhurst, New York. Shout out to you. Uh, this customer started 30 days ago. Uh, let's see his Equifax results. People, as you can see, that's June 14th. And right here we will go at least East Elmhurst right there. We're going to go down and see what we were able to uh, remove. All right, we see right here. See the tax lien right there has been deleted and also the judgment as well has been deleted and another account from Toyota Financial as well was deleted. Still got a couple more left but still great results. Well you already know I'm on my hustle. Shout out to you who start credit repair and are in the process and a patient. Easy credit, I'm on my hustle. So that's a customer that uh, was able to remove some negative accounts. Now look at this at this customer in which I was able to remove everything. Yo, my people, your boy Gizzy Credit here, back again, Monday Hustle. Hey, shout out to you who are on Instagram and you refer me, your customers or your friends and family. This actually customer came from one of you, so I just want to say thank you so much. Anyways, this customer uh, started a month ago from Queens Village, New York. Let's check out her Equifax file. See right there, June 9th. Let's go right here and see her Queens Village. All right, we go down now and see that we were able to remove all of, well, mostly all of her negative accounts that she came with. Why almost all of it? Because she added another negative while in the process, so she will be done by now. See that judgment right there? Everything deleted. Deleted, deleted that deleted. judgment. And if you know right here, another negatives, judgment. All right, has been deleted as well. So as you can see guys, this is a process just like anything uh, else with what I do and how I'm going to come through for you. I stay on top of my work, on, on top of doing everything the right way and uh, coming through the fastest. I know many of you who are in the credit repair process, you know that come Sunday like today, I'm always telling you to update all three bureaus or let me know when you could do this, let me know when you could do that and I have customers all over. Yes, I know that it's only me, but remember, I have a back office support. You can always email us if you have any questions. Uh, but more importantly, this video is for you who just finished starting credit repair. And let me tell you something, I have nothing but the best interest for you, and I want you to get the best results. So please, please stay on top of this. I know many of you who I've come through for already, already understand this. You can share this video with your friends. You can share this video with your strategic partners or your business partners who you want to start credit repair with me. I, I want to say thank you for the referrals. And let's just check out all the other social media where you can find me at and see uh, if you could refer me to uh, someone who may need my help. My people, as you know, you can always find me on Instagram. Here's my Instagram right now. Uh, I was working out, post on my videos. They're giving out credit repair results and just finished giving some uh, results for this customer who removed uh, one, one out of two negative accounts. Uh, you can also go to my uh, Facebook uh, page. This is my, uh, my uh, Facebook page that you, all you guys are just come to and um, you contact me through here. See, I got one message right here that I need to get back to. Uh, you already know also that you could contact me here on, um, on, on um, YouTube. 
Uh, as you can see right there, I'm almost up to 2 million views and I uh, have 10 point, uh, 10,500 subscribers. So definitely have a big responsibility. If you see right here, this is my uh, Google Plus where you can contact me here as well. Post all my videos here just to let people know that I'm constantly working. Uh, and also my Tumblr account here, you could see everything that I do. And also for the professional people out there, I do have a LinkedIn and I still need to uh, add a whole bunch of you who contact me. And of course, right now I have all these um, comments that I need to get back to on social media. So I promise that I'm going to get back to all you guys here through social media. Anyways, my people, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, this video is not more of a precaution for you, uh, but it's also for you to understand the process of what I have to deal with on a daily basis with not only, you know, people from all over the, the United States, uh, but also people who are like you who want to do credit repair exactly the same way that we do it. So I need to show this side of the business in order for the people who are want to be just like me and, and give out results just just like we do you know you need to understand the expectations that you're gonna set for your customer when I met my customers I told them this was gonna be a six month to 12 month process but now you know they they said that I wasn't coming through for them and it all goes back to not not updating their credit report them getting negative accounts in the credit report so how else are you going to feel if more negatives get added and that's not my responsibility you understand so understand that these negative accounts can be added to your credit before I'm still going to commit to you in removing them but you also have to commit into doing whatever it takes for you to get better all right this is like exercising all right you it's a process all right so just imagine if I'm gonna go and work and I'm a plumber in your house but you don't give me the tools for me to do my job and then you complain that I'm not done yet you understand what I'm saying anyways my people I hope you do and I know you do anyways you can contact me 973-440-8661 hit me up on all the social media and I'll get back to you and uh, if you want to share this video go right ahead Gizzy credit I'm on my hustle